Right, I wanted to make an updated video on how to sidechain using Soothe 2. This is going to be pretty straightforward, I just want to play you this example track I've put together right now in a few minutes. Right now this has no sidechain, so pay attention to the way that the kick is sort of getting lost. <laughs> Right, so let's get started here. I've got my kick on a mixer channel, and I've also bust everything that's going to be sidechained over here to track three. So what I'm going to do is click on the kick, and I'm going to sidechain it to that sidechain bus, like so. And then on that bus, we are going to open up Soothe 2, like this. So here it is. The first thing you want to change is hit the gear and go here. And then under the processing tab, you're going to have the option for sidechain input. You want to select your kick from that and then go back to the main plugin screen. And you want to press this little button here to enable sidechain mode. Now what you'll see, it is reacting to the kick. It's very barely doing it right now because we've not really dialed anything up. Like I'm gonna crank this pretty hard. That's doing it in a way. And this is where you want to dial it into like the region that you want it to affect and such. So I'm thinking mainly lows and it's going to be a lot less in the highs. And then of course we're going to dial it in so it isn't super in your face. Something like that's quite nice. And if we listen to the Delta so you can hear what it's doing. Kind of sounds pretty cool on its own, but that's just a very quick way of demonstrating it. And of course, now you could dial in your settings and get it right. Hope this video was useful to you. Drop a like if it was and subscribe for more. Thank you for watching.